<laughs> hey guys, we're back with another unboxing. Well, actually more of a Barbie color reveal. So this is Series 1 Barbie color, color reveal, and it says uh, seven, seven surprises. So you get, there's five different girls you could possibly get. I'll show you their artwork on the front here. You don't know who you're going to get, but I do have a theory on these, though. There is a number on the top up here. So, um, I believe I have the whole set, but today we're only going to open two. Um, I have a couple assistants helping me today. We have D over here on my side helping me with mine, and then we have Arya that's going to help with another one. So, we're going we're gonna to get started here. So, on the top here, we got a tear strip. It says open here. So, we're going to tear that strip. I can do tear that. You can tear that for me? Thank you, for, thank you assistant. What's happening here? What's happening here? Here, just peel the whole thing off. All right. Just peel it all off. The tear strip is is it was a dud. Uh -huh. All right. So inside, you're gonna see this Barbie that's pretty much engulfed in this uh, in water soluble yeah. paint. So when we fill this up, the paint should disintegrate, and we'll see what Barbie we get. Yeah. That's pretty cool, huh? Yeah. So we're gonna help Aria over here with hers too, and we're gonna have uh, we're gonna have like a little uh, reveal contest going on between the two of us. So uh, we're gonna fill up. See where this little fill up line is here? We're gonna fill our water up right to that fill up line. It has to be warm water. All right. Can and we do we're gonna. Can I do that? So you wanna fill this up with warm water, guys, and then you're gonna put your Barbie in there and submerge it in. And you're gonna close the cover and you're gonna watch it disintegrate. All right, guys. So we got we have our vials all. Filled up here. I'm gonna dump it in. So um, gonna in. Dee's gonna dump the doll in, but don't, but do it really slowly, okay? Because we don't want to have a big accident. All right. All right. Oh, it's not going in. Oh, 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 my! It, oh, right, put Ari, it put it in. Whoa! It is experiment, oh, science no! experiment. Okay. Oh, no. She doesn't have to put the cover oh. on. She can dunk oh. it with her hand if she wants. Um, what? She's gonna go in. Look at that. Oh, which one do I have? What do you what the heck's happening? The paint's disintegrating. The paint comes off? Yeah. The paint comes off. What's she gonna look like? Her... Oh, her head's floating off. I guess you do have to kind of do it with your fingers. Oh, uh, I got a puppy oh, one! Oh. oh, you are. Hang on. And she's got freckles! Ooh. Oh, we, don't, like... we don't have a face yet. Makes the whole water pink, which is perfect because it's Wait, Barbie, right? I guess it makes sense. Ready? We're gonna dump her like that. She's gonna go for a swim. Swim. Dunk on her head. Well, I think this is the color of her hair already, right? I think that is her hair color. She's got like a lavender color hair, or almost white. Yeah, this is like weird. Thing or something. This is cool science. Yeah. All right. So now we have. I have my girl revealed. Now they're not really too articulated when it comes to articulation. They can bend at the waist to sit a little bit. They don't really sit too much. But and then their arms. Their arms also move and their head moves back and forth. So it's limited, but you have to do. So you also have one, two, three, four blind bags. Here's your checklist. And here is your uh, guide. So, um. Mommy, can yeah. I see the unicorn? Yeah, we're going to see what she has. We're going to see what we got from, for accessories first. Um, it says, don't get this wet. All right, let's see this must be the wig. Uh, okay, so my first right, prize is. Oh, it says not to get the, the. It says not to get the dress wet, I guess. Yeah, all of this. Oh, okay. So, uh, mine has a, uh, a purple skirt that has light purple. Harps oh, and yeah. white hearts on it. Oh, oh, care! It comes with a sponge to do the makeup. Uh huh. That's what that's for. Wow! You just gotta. You actually have to have ice water, like wow. ice water in that. Yeah. Are you opening Ooh, up that for shoot. me? Is that the sponge? Oh, yeah. oh! I didn't know the sponges were different uh, shapes. Are you gonna hurt? So I got a pink star sponge, and you got a pink heart one. Yeah. Cool. Yeah. It's probably our shoes. They're blue. Yeah, they look like sneakers. Oh, cool! They're wedges. They're wedge sneakers. What'd you get in there, Ari? And they're purple. Here's her wig. Here's her wig, Auntie Carrie. Oh yeah. So she got a uh, um a light lavender with uh with the underneath part is dark dark pink. So we're gonna put that on. We'll show you her final look. 
So I'll show you guys her closer look at her, at her face. She has like a really light gray type eye. And she has freckles. Oh, it's not dunking anymore. No. We're going to get some ice water. We're going to put makeup on them. And then she has a bathing suit on that has a, uh, we already looked at that, the, uh, what, Boston, the Boston Terrier. And then here's her shoes. So not, nothing really, everything's pretty simple, but I think they had to use the simple body, um, for the type of gimmick that this was. Because if they used something with articulation, they, they, the paint would have got all inside and everything, and it needed to be solid, so I understand that. The wig, I already, I've already gone on rants about the wigs from these, so, but, um, they, they I just don't like that they, they, they could have gone a little bit closer with the edging. So the hair is going to change color too. You're going to get color streaks. Oh. Wipe it on there. Wipe it on it. Wipe it on like you're painting. Here, uh, See, she gets, um, she gets dark, dark purple streaks in her hair. Here, let's squeeze it. Okay. And we're, we're going to get... Oh, her, her eyes change color. And her hair, change her hair. Come on, Mom. Here, look, just do this. Oh yeah, her eyes change color, so she's got darker oh, blue eyes now. Look, Mary, look. And her eyeshadow. Her half, her half. Oh yeah, look at that. Oh, her oh, mine is darker lips. Look at the lips. Oh, is that cool? Yeah. It's pretty cool. I wonder if there's anything down here now. And look at her hair. Look at those streaks. They don't last though, do they? Yeah. It's not color memory then. I I think probably when it dries up, it just you just gotta do it again. But that's cool. Yeah, it is cool. Yeah. I think she looks pretty with and without the makeup, though. So, yeah. I think they have really pretty faces. I, have, I do too. They look like fashion, uh, like supermodels. So, yeah, that's all we have for you guys today. If you, if you like this video, I hope you like this video because you're going to be seeing more of these probably. Uh, give it a thumbs up and subscribe, and we'll see you in the next one. Bye, guys. Okay, guys. Um, I figured I would just show you her one more time. Since after I went and looked at the footage of me and Aria opening ours up, uh, you really couldn't see too much. So I'm going to see if I can savage that <laughs> and put this at the end. Uh, here she is with her wig on. From a distance, it, it's kind of like Monet. <laughs> From a distance, the wig looks kind of good. But once you, once you get up close, there's that terrible clear lining that makes it therefore look like a helmet wig. But... She has good qualities to her, too. She has a very gorgeous face, and I love the freckles. Um, luckily, the gimmick with this doll um, is... One of, one of the gimmicks with this doll is that you, you change the hair color and the streaks in the hair color. So um, I like that they gave us the option of either having the wig on or not. So that way, those of us can choose whether they want the wig or not. Because the pixie cut is actually not that bad. Um, let's see. And um, I'm not never have been crazy or a supporter of the um, molded on clothing, especially for Barbies. Shoppies, you can get away with it because they've been that way from the very beginning, but Barbies don't have to have it. I mean, I guess it, I don't know what the age level that they were aiming for for this, but I guess they figure if she strips, if she's stripped down, she's not naked, but you know what? <laughs> it doesn't make sense to me. I, I, I don't know. Just, just give me, uh, just give me a top. Give me, a, give me any kind of top. It's okay if they're naked. It's fine. Um, I, I excuse the the lack of articulation because, like I was saying before, uh, how this gimmick works, it makes more sense for her to have limited posability. Although I do wish, and this might have something to do with it as well, but I do wish that she could sit fully, but she can't. She can only sit like this. So you might you might be able to put her in a car, but she's gonna be having to have to lay all the way back. So that's kind of um, sad, but for the most part, my dolls get displayed standing up anyway. I mean, unless they're articulated, because they can get away with not having a stand because they can sit on the edge of the the, the the shelf. This I don't know. Maybe it'll get put in a bag for a future project because it's just not meant for her. Uh, unfortunately. She won't be wearing that in display. Um, I do have other unboxing videos coming up. I believe I have the whole set coming. I'm gonna do them one by one, though, because I talk too much and I won't be able to do them all in 
I'll be having, end up having like a two hour video. Um, yeah, so that's all we have for you guys today. If you like this video, go ahead, give it a thumbs up. If you don't like it, I understand. <laughs> and I'll see you in the next one, guys. Bye.